long as humans have worn fur and made perfumes, people have been perfuming their furs. But today, let's talk specifically about a trend from the early 1900s to the mid 1900s. The perfume makers created or marketed specifically for fur coats. Fur coats are made from the hides of dead animals, so as you can imagine, they kind of start to smell musty, which is the kindest word I can say about it. But the alcohol in perfumes isn't good for this type of garment because it can discolor them. So people were always looking for ways to not smell like dead animals, I guess. And they accomplished this by putting scented sachets and perfume oils in the coats. Several fur manufacturers got into the perfume industry for this reason. It started with Le Fourier Mat, the French one that is really hard for me to say, I'm sorry. And this was followed by probably the most famous of these brands, Val. And these guys got the idea to go into perfumes because their clients wanted something to make their coats and their stoles smell better. They released Four Scents in 1928, and they were Chinchilla Royale, Une Fleur Pour Fourier. It's so hard, I'm sorry. That one was basically make your fur coat smell like flowers. Ermine, and most famous, Zibeline, and that was for Sable interesting brand was that of Mary Grea. She was a fur manufacturer in the 1940s and also got into perfume. And not only was she a woman at a time where there weren't that many women in the industry, she took fur perfumes a step further by matching the perfumes in her line to the best type of animal fur. Some of her perfumes included Faisan, which was mink, Castor, which is beaver, Renard Arjan, which is silver fox, and Panther for panther. Cue sex panther joke from Anchorman. I'll leave off with the famous one by Len Vaughn, and that was Rumer. It was originally released in 1934, and it was specifically for furs, and then it was reformulated in 2006 by Francis Kirk de Jean of Baccarat Rouge fame. Let me know what other perfume histories you'd like to see, and check out the rest of my videos at the playlist below.